Uh, is it up? Maybe. And yeah, we're gonna we're gonna get good at this at one point. We. That's a lie. We're not. <laughs> look, uh, look, we're just gonna be mediocre at always and forever. It's fine. That's fine. Yeah. Hey guys, we're live. Hey, we're live. Are we? I think yeah, we are. Yeah, probably. Probably. I'm checking right now. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> yeah, we're live. Oh, okay, cool. Cool. Hey. Hey. We playing Monster Prom. Yeah, we is. Uh, maybe mute that, Janie. I don't Anyway, we're playing Monster Prom today. It's it doesn't fit the Cat Day live stream. Good job, Janie. That's well muted. Just turn it off. I have the chat running over here. Why do you need it on your phone? Oh God, I'm sorry. Okay, I'm turning it off right now. Yeah. Okay. So, anyway. Anyway. Look at all this mess. Yeah. We're playing Monster Prom. It's not Cat Day, except no, there's a cat. There's uh, a cat. There's right, a couple right of there. cats in there. That right there. Oh, that's a cat. Yeah, there's Kitty. Um, where's uh, the shopkeep? She should be in here somewhere. Uh, oh, no, we can't I don't find see her. her. She's, she's somewhere around here. Well, an intergalactic prince, though. Yeah. Anyway, we gonna play this today. Yeah. Because it's great, and we love it. Yes, because it's one of our favorite games. And we We're got the, the DLC. DLC! We gonna play the long game. Hell yeah. We're sharing a controller. Yeah, we share controllers. Ah, spooky high school. The sweetest years of our lives. This is where narrated voice come from. I yeah. stole it from Octopimp. <laughs> Back then, we were young and unafraid. Sometimes reckless, sometimes brilliant, sometimes just stupid, but always willing to live life to the fullest. Hey, Aaron. Oh, hey, boy. What's where up, you at? boy? How are you? Now we're on a wild journey to discover who we really were. <laughs> are you the shadow boy? Always shadow boy. Okay. What's your um, name? Last time I was boys to men. Okay. <laughs> um, okay, what theme do we want our names to be now? I don't know. Um, okay. I Bert. QWERTY. <laughs> Keyboard, Janie. I know. Should I, should I go with QWERTY? Do you want QWERTY, I guess? I don't know. I don't think I want to go for Robot Boy. Uh, okay. I won't be QWERTY if I'm not going for Robot Boy. I don't know. I'd say pick a movie. Let's see movie here. Title be your mom, your name, not your mom. Yeah, you that's know. that's a thing. <laughs> okay, I'm so tired. let's. Nah. Gregor me. Nah. Yep. Yep, okay. Shadow Boy is they, even though I call him Shadow Boy, but he is multiple entities. Look at that. Oh. Okay, Janie. I'm always her. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I feel like her, she personifies me as well. She's a good um, character, Janie. Okay. Alright, what's your name, Janie? I've been banned the last two times. Been bands last Yeah, Garugamesh is a band. Oh. Japanese band. I'm not very cultured. So let me do a band. <laughs> last time I was a last time I was a boy band. This time I'm a Japanese metal band. What what are you gonna be, Janie? I'm trying to think mm -hmm. of one right now. Pick a thing. I'm sorry. Do a thing, I'm Janie. Sorry. I'm trying. Okay. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Ninja 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 Sex Oh we going we going with a good band here Ninja Sex Party Oh I can't kick the fucking Oh no well, now you're just ninja sex part. Oh no. Oh, but you. Oh, what, fuck it. Janie? I'm just gonna use the initials. Ninja, NSP. NSP. It's ninja yeah. sex party. Yeah. Oh, NSP. Oh, NSP. <laughs> okay. Yep. She's a she. Sweet. Ninja sex party. And we've yet to experience its ultimate challenge the monster prom. Hell yeah. Oh, yeah. Wee. I remember it clearly. Three weeks were left, and as we fantasized about our dream prom dates, 
we were all scrambling to catch the attention of one of our eight most charismatic classmates. Scott Howell, 21. A werewolf athlete who compensated for his rather small brain with a stupidly huge heart. Miranda Vanderbilt, 19. A sweet mermaid princess who's as cute as she was genocidal. Look at that, look at that animation, she's adorable. Ah, Polly Geist, best Polly. girl. A party ghost with an insatiable hunger for all the wrong things. I love these new animations. I love it. Damien LeVay, a fearless demon with a taste for destruction and a love of fire. Uh. Liam Delancour, a hipster vampire whose standoffish demeanor hid the fact that he was truly in a truly a lovable dork. Zo Forever? An eldritch cutie who went from endless deity of the dark realms to an ultimate fangirl. I'm I'm into her, Janie. Okay. Calculesta Hewlett Packard, version <laughs> one point oh. A library com computer who had become a sentient robot ready to experience life to its fullest. And Vera Oberlin, twenty three, a mean self made gorgon with a merciless sense of business. Oh my god, you could see one of her both of her eyes on that. Mm -hmm. What the? Fuck? It was clear it had to be one of them, but who? We only had three weeks to choose our prom date. We even more daunting. We only had three weeks to woo them and conquer their heart. But as I already said, we were young and unafraid, and we were ready to start. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, hand me the thing. <clears throat> I'm gonna be the first one picking. Welcome to the Monster Prom stupidest pop quiz ever. All mines are rotten, but they're rotten in so many different ways. <laughs> Worry no more, because we're using our PhD and bullshit to diagnose what kind of deviant sicko you are. I'm just drinking my cold black coffee. Yeah. Lots of problems, stupidest pop quiz ever. TM, we'll throw a bunch of absurd questions at you and turn your answers into character stats. Mm hmm. This way, each of you will start by having stats that better reflect your true selves. Excellent. Let's start. Get the chance to produce a movie. It's based on something about superheroes, but the love triangle between a beautiful yet somewhat relatable girl. Maybe she's always st stating she's a mess. I don't know. Mm -hmm. uh, and are two of the super hot superheroes, which are also like vampires <laughs> or pirates or both. Instant hit. Oh my god. Uh huh. Uh, two cool guys walking away from rad explosions, and they don't look at the explosion. They don't give a fuck about the explosions. Yeah. They reflect on life and love, but it's super dope and kick ass because they do. Lusa walking away from never-ending explosions. Oh my god. Michael Bay. All right. All right. Uh, the most influential Russian novelist of the... Oof. 20... Or, no, 20... No, that's... No, that's 10... Oh. 10 one ten. That's... Hmm. Century uh. <laughs> have gone nuts. They don't have... They don't remember anything about last night, and now they can't find the manuscript of the brothers Karamzov? And Dostoevsky has to deliver it today. Good job. I would. I'm just. Kidding. I, don't I don't know what that's about. All right. I, it looks like something. it looks like a, a fucking. It looks like a Hangover crossover. Oh my god. I want this one too, but I also like this one a lot. <laughs> do do the one you feel, Janie. This one. Cool. More wealthy. Awesome. Eat. School is outdated and lame. We need a school sub new school subject ASAP. How to correctly punch a crocodile without terrible consequences. Could Good. have thought. I mean, damn, this country could use really use a subject like that in our schools. Turning people into your puppets through emotional warfare and deception. What I want. Oh my god. Which one are you gonna pick? I mean, that one already is high school. Yeah. That's that's all high school is. That's what I learned in high school. Um, this one. That's what I thought. Because I think it would be hilarious. Just go punch a crocodile. In the punch face. a crocodile in his goddamn <laughs> face. Ye ye ye. Find your zodiac to be inaccurate. Design your own personal zodiac sign. The ambiguous iguana, the regal 1%, the randomly arranged set of stars, the rad sword of fire, the happy go lucky ecstasy pill, the oh, nail cannon look. Sorry. I touched the control. Uh, you find your zodiac sign. Was it, what is this? I wasn't paying attention. Sorry. Inaccurate design of you your own personal zodiac in. sign. <laughs> Uh. Hmm. Uh. I mean. I don't know. I think in the 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 DLC, don't you get two chances to choose yeah. between characters? 
Uh, so this one's definitely Polly. It is. All right, I'm gonna go with. But I don't see a, an elder horror girl oh, God. answer here. Not I one that's not I'm one that go says horror girl one. to me. Oh, I no! got her! I got her! <laughs> I'm sorry, Janie. How could you betray me? I'm so me? sorry. If you were an ice cream, which flavor would you be? Rainbows, gummy bears, plutonium, success, meat, spicy chocolate, nose chocolate on fire, double, double creme de la gray. Gruyere, Jamie. Gruyere and meringues. It's, it's a cheese. Read. I'm sorry. Mm. <laughs> you say me all the time, though. Yeah, but that's a Scott answer. Okay. Uh, this one. All right, I'm gonna go with plutonium because I think that's yeah. Yeah, it's Robot Boy. Ah, uh, and you got Liam. Yeah, I'm either going for Liam or Polly now, but I think in the long with the long game I can make it. Different I, I could route. It's curve the swerve yeah. to, into my favor for the peeps. I, I think I can do that. Maybe it's loading. Give me, give me that controller, Jeannie. Okay. Uh, okay, Mr. Grabby Gill. Loading. We fucked it up it's, already. I don't know how yeah, it's. We already broke uh, it. You already Wait. broke it. Oh, okay. You got Can eleven rematch. smarts and four on everything else except Wow. Me. Cool. Nice. I am middle of the road, hardcore. Uh, what's the thing? Yeah, there we go. Um, I could use pretty much anything. Let's go oh. with creativity. Okay. Bam. That day while rehearsing for the class play, it's as though the muses themselves have descended to give you a figurative blowjob. Yeah. Your performance is intense and inspiring. It will be remembered for generations. Was it bleh bleh bleh. Which is pretty rad by <laughs> high school play standards. Nice. You gain plus two creativity. Nice. You spot Liam and Polly talking about- wait, talking about a party or something. Parties are cool, so you decide to join them. Who's gonna be Liam, Janie? I don't know, your mark baby scissors for it. Be Liam. Huh? Do a Liam voice. Oh. I thought I was gonna be Polly. Uh, I don't know. Doesn't oh, matter. Whatever. <clears throat> There's plenty of people to voice. Look, if you don't want to listen to me, that's fine. But inviting everyone to the party on Facebook is going to make it seem unbelievably lame. Lame. But if I make a monster Facebook invite, like, nobody will know where to go or what time to get there. We'll have to get, like, six guests. They'll be cool guests. But <laughs> a uh -huh. good party is about exclusivity. Uh -huh. No way. A good party is about getting hammered with a bunch of people who don't remember what you did in the morning. Fuck. Yeah. Let's agree to disagree on that. Or we could ask our friend to resolve this for us. You, what do you think of the best way to invite people to our party? Okay, so, let's see here. Here's what you do. You hand you hand a letter, three flyers with the party info, and then hide them in the bathrooms of the three coolest coffee houses in town. Whoever finds these invitations deserves to be at your party. Okay. Well, obviously, the answer is to take a topless selfie and then use Photoshop to cover your nipples with the party info. <laughs> print that shit out, plaster it all <laughs> over school. I guarantee people will come in more ways than one. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I don't know if I have stats for either of these. I don't, I don't know, know if, it's, if it can set you up for failure like that. But I'm going what with the poly answer, but I'm not oh. bold enough. Wow, like, I can't Oof, even... man. I am set out for failure from the beginning. Oh, man. You wanted to see me- you wanted to see my boobs, so you could've just asked straight out shit. Well, I'm even supposed to find a printer. This isn't the fucking 90s. Uh -huh. Like, I don't- just fax everybody the invite. That seems like a legit idea. Perv. Wait, what? There's a thin line- wait. I lost two boldness. You lost a bold And one fun. Yeah. No, two but, fun and one but boldness. But you gained a heart with her. That's weird. That's- yeah. Let's go. Alright, well. I'm- oh. I don't know who I'm going for. I don't know. I'm gonna go to the library, I guess. Or no, you got wait. You got both the new characters. Uh, do I want to be more bold, though? I don't know, Janie. Uh, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. I'm gonna just kind of really power level that boldness. Yeah. That day you skip class and just hang out in the bathrooms because you respect no authority. Fuck yeah. Yeah, doing the thing. I guess some people just want to watch the world burn. Yeah. By skipping class and, you know, hanging out in the bathrooms. You give plus zero shit, but you gain plus two boldness. Oh yeah. <gasps> ah! 
Yeah. Oh god. But, uh... By the way, um, guys, we're not going to be releasing these live streams in bulk. Yeah. Because we decided that they're hard to watch. Yeah. Yeah. So, so we're going to try and split them up into shorter ones and release them slowly throughout the week. Make them easier to watch. You're going to handle the editing on that, because I do all the other editing. That's fine. <laughs> Okay. Uh, you catch the tail end of a classic Zo Calculester exchange. A, a student X texture fic is so OP. Okay, Janie, you're gonna have to talk up or get closer to the mic. Yes. Okay. But a teacher X, a uh, student X teacher fic is so super overdone, makes me super uncomfortable. Like the inherent balance of power, like how could you even imagine how problematic that is? And PGS, like hooked up with one of us, like fucking yuck. Uh huh. Yeah. Hmm, let's see. Ooh, that Jack Scepter guy. Uh, mm hmm. I cannot seem to recall what principal giant spider looks like anyway. Image.pgs not found. Yeah. All the joys of new students adjusting to the rules of Spooky High. <gasps> oh my god! Wow, who is this? <laughs> who, who is this? This is one of the new people that. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> one of the new people that one of the new people that I was like, I don't want to go for her, but she's like a hidden character. Yeah, she you got to do a bunch up. of routes before she, before you can actually go she for her. She just popped or? up here, so awesome. Maybe you can go for her, Janie. Okay. You there, killing machine and abyssal terror. Um, rude. I need an impressive ally to fight against the reign of the Leves. Oh, over the eighth circle of hell. Oh my God. Input quippy response about your sense of fashion being from the eighth circle of hell. Uh, look at his face. <laughs> I have no need for your robo-criticisms. What I need is the power of a being beyond the average monster to aid in my glorious and righteously justified takeover. <gasps> oh, thanks. I would just rather write a Stevie fanfiction in which you and Damien are a crack ship who hate who hate sex just to, to annoy you for annoying us. Well, we need to act now while the king and King, well, King and King LeVay are distracted by throwing an admittedly adorable theme brunch. I'm not leaving without one of you to go with me. Oh, God. Holy shit, she really means it. <laughs> A time to help one of your classmates out. Guess you better decide which one you don't like. School is full of tough choices. No! Oh, God! <laughs> okay, Janie. Your choice. I'm gonna tell you right now, pick a bold answer because that's the only stat you got. Fuck me. Okay, hold on. So... I have to either throw one of them or the other one to her. Oh, hey, bro. Hey. Um, to throw them to her and they might not be in the game Maybe. anymore. Maybe. I don't know, Janie. Oh, shit. Uh, Dahlia, don't be fooled. The Seltress is clearly under Damien's spell already. Look at all these pictures she drew of Damien shirtless. She's a LeVay sympathizer. No, That's the calling true. this robot is a killing machine is inaccurate. A real killing machine would be a tank. And he's not a tank, so he's worthless. Go look for a tank. Oh god, just take me instead. I I I, I don't <laughs> I don't, wanna... I don't see that option, Janie. I know. <laughs> um I don't know, so you're gonna try to go for Zoe? I'm gonna try and go to Zoe if if it'll let me. <laughs> okay. I don't know which I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if it actually takes one of them out. Uh <laughs> oh god. Pick the one you think you can get, Janie. Hmm? I don't hmm? know. Uh, 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 okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> a tank? You want me to take a tank into the inner circles of hell? What a genius idea. Those arrogant levees will never see it coming. They might expect an attack from a fellow demon. Albeit one superior in looks, skill, and talent, far more deserving of ruling the eighth circle of hell. But an attack by a tank? That's something the king and king would never anticipate. That was shockingly easy. True. I think it'd still be kind of steamy if they put inside their distance from some hot demon deep in action. Emotion found. Gratitude. Initiate sequence thankfulness to NSP. NSP, I'm thankful for your help. Thank you for it. Finish sequence gratitude with expression heart. Oh. Ah, ah, look at that. How is a computer posing as a monster living as, as a student so cute? Ugh, what a cutie pie. Also cute. Gaining plus two charm and plus one fun. Oh my god. Yeah, Janie's, Janie's named her character NSP. My character's name is Garugamesh. 
We're bands. Yep. Oh. Everybody, everybody chooses an activity. Say your choice out loud to the rest of the players before clicking. Um, cart jousting. <laughs> <laughs> just, just take your time. Take your time. Drinking. Drinking. Yep, there you go. Player orders decided based on how weird yet interesting your next Tinder date it would be if it was revolved around doing... Oh yeah, Jane, go first. Yeah. Cart jousting. Yep, Fuck do yeah. cart jousting. <laughs> Week one, noon. Sweet. Okay. Alright. Alright, Janie. Um, you do know the secret of the DLC. Yes, and I it do. is an option. I do. Is I it am. an option you want to take? I don't know. I kind of want to go... I want to... I want to be charmed by this robot boy. Oh, okay. It's up to you, Janie. I don't know. Or, or I might steal the lich from you. I'm kind of debating about uh, it. It's a lich? That's not a lich. lich. Sorry, not the lich. It's an eldritch horror. Oh, sorry. I'm having a brain fart. Gosh, Janie. Sorry. No, you're monsters. Thank uh, God a lich. Huh? Thank God a lich. I know. I'm tired. Uh, who are you going for, Janie? Uh, it's all up to you. Oh, oh boy. You know the old joke. A robot and a vampire sit down at a cafeteria table to not eat. <laughs> Morning narrator is Chisel. Damn yeah, it. Yeah, he is. <laughs> Friend Liam, you seem quite focused, thus I apologize for interrupting. Oh, I got look at his shirt. Look at his, look at his Hawaiian shirt. Yeah. It's so good. But I cannot help noticing that you are frequently absorbed in your technology to the exclusion of all else. Mm -hmm. As a piece of technology myself, I must admit to being the synthetic equivalent of flattered. But something does not compute. I spend my days and nights longing for organic connection. <laughs> trying and failing to artificially generate the sensation of being loved. Oh my god. But you, with the entire organic population of this high school at your fingertips, Choose to instead use those fingertips to stimulate your smartphone device. Mm -hmm. It intensifies my loneliness just to watch. Get into that feeling. Loneliness is the third coolest emotion right behind Sunere and none. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Excellent. <laughs> I do not wish to lean into that feeling. Liam, I wish for you to lean out of it. Don't know what you're asking, Cal. Do you know how many photos are shared on Instagram alone every fucking hour? 3,958,333.33 repeating. It's supposed to be a rhetorical question, but you've only straightened my point, which is this. What if. What if, while I was away from a phone seeking organic connection, was one of those Instagram posts were to be bad? Who would boast. A devastating and convincing emoji. Condescending. Who would iconic, ironically shared among the gif of Marcel Duchamp blandly smoking a cigarette? Uh huh. Who, I ask you, who? The internet is defenseless about me. You cannot miss a moment. In counterpoint, this is unhealthy and bad, and you should not do it anymore. Man, computer boy just looking out for Liam. Yeah. Wow, things are getting pretty heated at this cafeteria table. You'd better resolve this dispute one way or the other before your ice cream melts. <laughs> Alright. Alright, hold on. Obviously Calcul you're going with Calgary Lester, yeah. I'm gonna go for the robo boy. Calculus or Riley, um, how about you, instead of burying your pink-tinged nose in your phone, get updates via Puppet Show Calculuster, and I will now perform for you! Puppet Show. I would be grateful for the opportunity to engage in your organic life form custom of pretending inanimate objects, as I once was, have thoughts and feelings and opinions as I do now. Yes. Of course, a robot doing a puppet show. It's so meta! Mm, yeah. <laughs> All that I do is metal, for metal is what I am made of. Excellent. Oh, hey, Yay! Emmy! Boop. What? Oh, yeah. Incorrect auditory input. Apologies. I realize that you said meta. The puppet show will be meta friendly. -um. We will make it all that you want and more. 
And so you do. Calculus to uses the internet in his mind to get all the information Liam would have gotten from his various platforms. Which you and Calculus to then translate through puppetry in the style of... Oh god. Bu bu oh, Bunraku, sorry. In the style of Bunraku, Weyeng Kulit, Guggenol <laughs> Marionettes, and Julie Taymor. <laughs> I'm Excellent. Glad Liam was finally off his phone, and you and Calculus had a wonderful ar an artistic bonding experience. Yeah, me and my Robo Boy. Beautiful. All right. Where are you going? E. Oh, hey. <laughs> Flipping peeps off. Uh, Perfect. Janie, do I? Where do you want to go, man? Who do you want to impress? Uh. Who do you want to talk to? Wait, it's not. It's not giving me the option. What? Oh, go to the. Oh, are you going? Are you going to the secret room? Well, it won't. It won't let me. Oh no. I don't. It won't let me do it. Uh, yeah, oh. that's. It's. It's not a thing. It won't let me do it. Oh. Yeah. Eh. Oh no! We can't talk to Chisel Boy. I don't know why it won't let me. That's so dumb. Lame. Maybe we didn't pick the right options no. in the beginning. Maybe. All right. Well. I guess. I'll go with the elder chore. <laughs> you arrive at Zone Vera's table, excited to. We're not doing anything suspicious. So. Oh, I forgot that you were also Vera. Yeah, this is hard. <laughs> I don't have a Good, lot of voices. Good, Janie. Good. Now right. you get to do all the voices okay. too. All right. We definitely were a fellow student in a cage under the table, and you, a fellow student, have a cage under the. the, the uh... <laughs> I know. I, I really wanted to get with that yeah. dark chiseled slender man. God, I wanted to talk to him too. Okay. I already read that. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's useless, Vera. Your mesh is too perceptive. We've got to come clean. This problem is clearly you're just too. Okay, guys. If you can't hear Janie, let us know, please. I'm sorry. I know I'm I'm quiet. <laughs> but I suppose we have no choice. Look at the table. Zonvir do indeed seem to have caged a fairy under the table. She's filthy, miserable, and covered in glitter. Oh Fairies God. cry glitter. <laughs> Wonderful. We took her prisoner during the last food, you know, for leverage. I didn't think anything of it at the time because taking a tormenting picture is just a thing you do as an elder god and like... But that was like three days ago and she's starting to swell. We've got to figure out something else to do with her. Oh, smell. Sorry. Yeah. We could just let her go? See the feel that profits me. Yeah, that makes sense. We should, you know, what should we do then? Um... The prisoner is probably stinking because she's lonely. Get her a companion to keep her company. Or <laughs> use vicious psychological manipulation to turn her into a sleeper agent, of course. Oh god. <laughs> mm, that's probably the Vera one. Yeah. We'll go with this one. Okay. Yeah. It's like I used to say when I was a dark manifestation of hatred and madness. Misery loves company. Oh my god. Huh. Ah. <laughs> Very swell with captivity. Yes. Misery loves company and I love misery. I'm gonna add another. Oh, a prisoner is a big responsible. Oh. I know. Feed I, it I love it this out. purple monster girl. <laughs> mm hmm. Yes, it's so much fun. <laughs> Who's gonna clean up after it? Who's gonna, like, feed it? That's the cool part. If my prior experience of Mistress of Extreme Pain is anything to go by, they'll just feed off of each other. Oh, yeah. each other. Yeah, that, that makes sense. That's cannibalism. That is an interesting cost-cutting measure. <laughs> then it's agreed. I love doing good deeds. Wonderful. <laughs> so it's the best. And you love letting your hot friend think she's doing a good deed so you can hopefully smooch her later. Everybody wins. 